The Lord be praised. What brings you to me? How goes it, sir? Are you recovered? I am, for all the good it does. The boredom here. The only thing I have to read is the Bible. And the Hanush won't let anyone near me but the priest. Have you any idea the monotonous drivel that fella comes out with? This world is but a trial. Be repentant. He talks to me as if I'm about to breathe my last. Actually, he talks to me as if I were already dead. Listen, Henry, won't you come with me to the Raté bars? I, I need a change of scene before moss starts growing on me. Why not? When do you want to go? I shall go there right away, but wait until at least dusk to join me. I'll have company there. All right, I'll come and join you there. What do you need, sir? I need you to do me a favour, Henry. What, again? Now, what's your turn, peasant? Well, you never think it. But Stenna here is a demon at dice. She stripped me bare ass naked. I couldn't even get a ribbon off her. <laughs> well, I'll rip everything off her then, eh? Good God! You do that to such a fragile flower? Who I pay for? Right then, you've got to beat Stenna at dice. I refuse to be the only one here with his up. All right. Why the hell not? How about a game of dice, then? Are you sure? What would I do with two naked men here? <laughs> Let's see how good you are. Good luck, sir. You haven't exactly gone off to a good start, have you? You're a brave soul taking me on. I'm not used to losing. will be the one. Damn. It seems there's method in your madness. Hmm. Maybe you'd have more luck if you'd remembered to throw the other dice. That's all. My, my. Some real competition at last. You know I let you win.
I could do with a good soak too. Then strip off and hop in here. All right, why not? Put your clothes in the trunk. Shift over. You don't want to tread on anything vital. All right, just give me a moment and I'll roll it up again. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. That feels good. Man, don't take this personally, but I've never seen a man more in need of a wash. <laughs> I've known cow pats less fragrant. <laughs> <laughs> you certainly know how to have a good time. Here, yeah, drink. It's not terribly high quality, but it should do the job. I don't mind if I do. Give me that. That's the spirit. So this is how you recuperate from your injuries? Booze and wenches? Of course. Is there any other way? So, what news, Henry? Have you heard the executioner has a sweetheart? You don't say. Who is she, a revenant? No, a regular mortal. Her name's Eliska. Eliska? I don't believe I've had the pleasure. She's the wife of a man he executed. Good Lord. Well... I suppose that's the only way you could get a woman. Never mind about me. What about you? Have you recovered from our hunting adventure? I'm well enough, Henry. These baths are just the thing, and Zena here is very healing. Clara, bring some wine for the gents before they get cross. You know what, Henry? We really can't drink this local piss. Henry, I'm glad you stopped by. Clara, my most favouritest bathmaid. But, but admit it, my dear, the wine you have here is pit, 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 pitiful. What's wrong with the bathhouse wine? I'd rather drink the bath water. You should go... Ah! I know. In the cellars under the rat's house. And you want me to go there and get it now? Well, I'd be indebted to you. And a grateful nobleman. All right, then. What kind of wine is it? A silver and red. In the cellar under the rat's house. It's the last barrel at the end on the right-hand side. All right, then. I'll bring it. Good man. Good luck, then. Hey, you! What are you doing here? Lord Capon sent me to get some wine for him. Lord Capon, eh? A likely story. You clearly don't know Lord Capon. Do you think he's going to leave in the middle of his merriment to go and get his own wine? Ha! <laughs> no, that doesn't sound like the young Lord. I suppose he sent you for the Sylvan Red. The very one. Well, you'll leave some for Sir Hanush at least, won't you? <laughs> I'll try.
So, about that wine you sent me for. Well, have you got it? Of course. You really broke into the cellar at the Rat House? I certainly did. I hope that... I don't believe it. You really broke... But, sir, you asked me to do it. Jesus, Henry. You'd be talking... Well, let's see if this wine is as good as you say. What are you waiting for? The parish priest's blessing? Come on, then. Get it down, you... Sylvan red. Yeah, as you say, sir. Sylvan red. The taste. Flowers. What? <laughs> what? What kind of um, flowers do you like? Ah, uh, well, I like all kinds. I like dandelions, uh, sage, knotweed, and poppies. I really like poppies. Oh, Henry, did you hear that? <laughs> what? The lady requests da dandelions. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, S sage, mm -hmm. uh, cabbages. <laughs> not right. No, no, not weed and poppies. <laughs> what? <laughs> you, you want me to go flower picking now? I know, I know. I'm putting you to work again. But if you do it, I'll give you scrivency. Robin Groshen. <laughs> <laughs> that much. <laughs> All right. I'll go. <sighs> <sighs> what was it she said? Sage something, something else, and roses. Yeah. What would a bouquet be without roses? There's some in the upper castle garden.
are you doing here? I'd like some privacy if you don't mind. You've come for my wench. Well, as you can see, I'm not your wench or anyone else's, so fuck off. What are you doing with my Clara, you cunt? Archie, stop that. He's just bathing here. Bathing here, is he? With all the wenches but you are whores. Archie. But are you whoring now, too? That's enough, Archibald. <laughs> Archibald? <laughs> you shut your mouth. I'm not done with you. No, I swear the gentleman hasn't touched me. Actually, that's quite true. Um, well, mostly. No, nothing happened. Nothing. We can talk about this later. First, I'm dealing with this bastard. I'd like to see you try, arson balls. <laughs> Oh, some balls! For the love of God, stop it, both of you! Fuck you now! Hey! What do you think you're doing? <laughs> <laughs> I'll send you no, some bad man manners! What the hell got into you? Trying to drown a nobleman? Shit. Fuck. <coughs> I, I didn't know. Get out of my sight. Go on before I remember I can have you hung. I apologize, your lordship. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Archie, wait. Oh. Whew. I nearly got drowned by arson balls. <laughs> oh, that's the least relaxing bath I've ever had. Fuck, I feel like I've swallowed the Baltic. Oh, drinking will be the death of you. Damn right. Is there any wine left? Are you out of your fucking mind? You want to carry on? Of course. Well, don't tell me you don't fancy a drink after all that. And what will you do with them, Sir Hans? <laughs> what, with arson balls? I don't know. What do you think I should do with him? He was drunk and insane with jealousy. I'm sure he'll be sorry when he sobers up. But he tried to drown a nobleman. I can't just let him off. He didn't know who you were. Anyway, if you let him off, you'll show that you're the better man. I suppose you're right. Fuck him. <laughs> but we had some pretty good sports, eh? Take care.